careful with this music. Anyways, sorry about that. Hello, hello, Numa Numa 2 here, and welcome to another First Impressions. Um, I'm so excited. This is the first one. This is the first First Impressions I've done in a while since Dragon's Dogma 2, so I'm really excited for this. Um, I think this one I might play a little bit. I might play longer. I don't know. We're going to see how I feel. But anyways, we are looking at the game Sunnyside, uh, unless I'm wrong. I believe this game just came out today, which while recording, so uh, June 14th. But I have had this game has been on my radar s probably since it became available to pre-order on Steam. Uh, I, as you guys probably know, those of you who either know me or watch me, I play a, a ton of life sims, farming games, all that jazz. This is right there. This is what it is. Um, it, I remember it looked cool. It looked like it had a, really, a lot of really cool concepts. And it's been on my wish list for literally years. I think they first announced it in 2021 or 2022. But either way, I'm so excited. I'm really excited to try it. Um, like I said, it came out today on Steam. Um, and I just couldn't, I'm just, I'm hype. Let's get into it. Okay. We have five categories that we rank these games on. Visuals, gameplay, soundtrack, setting, and story. Let's get into it. We're going to start with visuals. So initially I had written down, I actually, at the very start of the game, I had one heart. Um, at the second, uh, as I got a little bit more into it, it went up to two. And we're ending it with three out of five hearts for visuals. It's not amazing. Um, the clothes look painted on. I don't love that. It's very much just like a texture. Um, however, comma, the animations are surprisingly fluid, uh, for it, and I like the overall aesthetic. I think it's a good combination of that kind of cel-shaded cartoonish with somewhat realistic styles. I like it. I do. I also have written down Gabriel tongue emoji, no notes. So there's that. Um, so yeah, so visuals, three out of five hearts. Next we have gameplay. We're going to, I'm going to give it a four out of five hearts. I have a feeling it's going to go up once I'm introduced to a, a couple more of the game mechanics. But honestly, the good, as much as I complained about the look of the character builder, it was very robust. It had a lot of options, which you don't see, especially in life sims, especially in smaller team developed life sims. So phenomenal. Um, the other thing, the farming is pretty simple. It's intuitive. Uh, I love how you water in this game. It's a lot less annoying. Um, than it is in other games. I like that it doesn't take up energy, I don't think, but that either way, it didn't take up enough for me to notice. Uh, the vehicle summoning is really cool. I love the phone, all the phone mechanics. Best part of the gameplay, in my opinion, though, outside of the, of the obvious stuff, the, and I'm not gonna really know this until I get a little bit further, but the, the uh, relationship mechanic using the IM app on the phone is insane. It's so unique, it's so cool. Um, I hope you get branching answers later on, um, which would be kind of cool because then it like changes how you text. So I do hope that happens. Um, but I do, I like the uh, ask to hang out, ask, ask out aspect. That's so cool. Um, looks like there's a lot of options for romance too, which is big for me. Uh, next we have soundtrack, five out of five hearts. Did I say, yeah, gameplay was four out of five hearts, sorry. Yeah, soundtrack, five out of five hearts. I love it. It's very... It's cozy, it's good, it keeps you feeling comfortable. I love that you'll have the opportunity to purchase these later. I'm assuming that has to do with stuff like uh, like record players in your house or something like that. But either way, I absolutely adore it. Um, so yeah, soundtrack, five out of five hearts, not a lot of notes, it's just a good soundtrack. Next we have the setting, five out of five hearts again. It's cute. I am a sucker for a small town. I like a small town with a realistic layout, which this kind of has other thing i also really love it's somehow modern but nostalgic there's a lot of older looking buildings mixed with newer buildings you can tell the game is supposed to show that was built later on additions i love how important tech is in this town even though it's a farm town i think that's really fascinating so absolutely five out of five parts sunnyside is a phenomenal location and setting and i adore Lastly, story, I'm giving it three out of five hearts. We haven't witnessed a lot of the story. I do like this is, it's kind of a different twist on the usual setup. You didn't inherit this from your grandparents. Um, I like that you just kind of, it almost Animal Crossing style, you just move to a new town and hope for the best. And I really like that. A um, little unrealistic, but it's fine. Usually these games are unrealistic. So I love that. The 
I am interested to see where the alien storyline takes us because I was not expecting that. With the setting and everything, I was really expecting a more fantastical, like how Coral Island and Harvest Moon does the sprites and the, and the goddess and all that stuff. But it seems like it's leading more towards science fiction, which is really cool. Um, things I'm looking forward to seeing, though, are going to be like the how the animal system works, the pet system, the, ro the romance system. But enough of that. Our final score. So again, visuals three out of four heart or three out of five hearts. Gameplay four out of five. Soundtrack five out of five. Setting five out of five. And story three out of five. Overall, we are landing at a four out of five hearts for Sunny Side, and that is a good score, um, especially for again. I hope I'm not saying this and it turns out like Microsoft was the main lead behind this, but for a what I am imagining is a smaller studio or at least a lesser known studio, phenomenal work. I am engrossed and this game is going to, it's got me already. I'm very interested in it and I can't wait to play more of it. But that being said, this was fun. Hey guys, okay, first impressions, kind of my longest one. I don't know how long the actual video is going to be, but I recorded for about two hours and 50 minutes, almost three hours. So thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed today's video, please subscribe, like, and or comment. Oh, also Sunnyside on Steam for like 30 bucks. It's not even expensive. Get it. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, as always, if you enjoyed today's video, please subscribe, like, and or comment. Also, feel free to check out my TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram, which are all linked in the description below. Beneath that, you'll find a link invite to the Discord channel, so feel free to hop on in and join the 282. Thanks again for watching, though, everybody, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye! I love this game. Everyone is so hot. Oh. <sighs>